After Huss was delivered up to the secular authorities, he was asked one last time if he wanted to recant. What errors shall I renounce, he asked. I know myself guilty of none. He was brought to this very spot here in Constance and they burned him to death. They had to light the fire three times. They wanted to ensure his body was completely consumed. They dug up his ashes along with the soil under him and threw it into the Rhine River. About a year later, Jerome was also brought to this same spot. And as his executioner was standing behind him, Jerome said, apply the fire before my face. Had I been afraid, I should not been here. They died with heroic bearing. And a zealous papist commenting on the death of Huss and Jerome said these words. Both bore themselves with constant mind when their last hour approached. They prepared for the fire as if they were going to a marriage feast. They uttered no cry of pain. When the flames rose, they began to sing hymns, and scarce could the vehemency of the fire stop their singing. Both these men lived their lives 100% for God, so that when they died, as tragic as it was, they died with no regrets. If we live our lives today 100% for God, fully surrendered to Him, we also can live a life where we have no regrets.